there, guys. <laughs> oh, it's in my fucking eyes. <laughs> fucking son of a bitch! Like, imagine this shit in Soviet Russia. They would not have this. Just what you want me to? Do you want me crucified? Oh, yeah. The Amish are in Florida. Hello, I'm Mediocre Montgomery, and, uh, today... <laughs> I'm Comrade Cogburn. I'm actually Mediocre Montgomery. Welcome back to the Mediocre Militia. Uh, I have a super highly anticipated video for you. I'd like to introduce you to the new Henry Axe. It's a trick. Get an axe. It's chambered in two and a half inch 410 shot shells, two and a half inch only. It really reminds me of like the old like Bonnie and Clyde whip it guns where they would like hide it up under their coat and whip the fucker out because of like the short profile and barrel. It has a roughly a 16 inch barrel and I think it's a uh, hair over 26 inches overall length. So that means that this is a non-NFA item. So there is no uh, $200 tax stamp, all that horse shit. On the website, it, it said that it weighs right under six pounds, roughly. Everyone's gonna be like, well, can you one hand it? And uh, it's actually not that bad. The sights are a little crude. Uh, you basically don't have a rear sight. It's just a brass bead front sight, like on a bunch of like single barrel shit tier break action shotguns, you know? So if you're used to that, you should feel right at home with this. It's got a little bit of an enlarged lever loop, so I mean, like, I'm, I've been using gloves cycling it, and it is just fucking wonderful. It also allows you to cowboy the gun a little bit, if that's your cup of tea. Um, be safe. It does come from the factory with the ability to put sling points on it. So that's that's really, really cool. Uh, it, this thing would make a hell of a backpacking gun. It's a smooth bore. It comes with a full invector choke straight from the factory. Uh, side loader and like standard Henry's. You can just drop rounds right in. But the side gate allows you to top the gun off at any point if you feel the need to, which is really cool. Because uh, I really do like being able to just drop rounds in really fast, but you know, that being your only way of reloading the gun would be a little bit of a hindrance in my opinion. This gun is also drilled and tapped, uh, just like your girlfriend after she gives me a call. The wood furniture uh, is gorgeous American walnut. That's one of the great things about these Henry's is they're all made in the USA. Um, you know, if that's like important to you, it's not really super important to me. I like all guns. The craftsmanship is unparalleled. Uh, this, th this thing is built like a brick shit house. It's wonderful feels super, super solid. Um, MSRP is right at about $1,000. Uh, at least that's what it says on the website. I managed to pick this one up uh, for right about 820, I think. It has a capacity of five rounds, five plus one if you're feeling cheeky and you want to load one into the chamber. It doesn't have a half cock notch, which is one of my gripes because I kind of like having a half cock notch on my guns, but it does come with a transfer bar, which is a little reassuring. Um, personally, I don't think I would recommend loading six, but you could, if, you know, if you're feeling cheeky. One of the other gripes I have about the gun, um, is this, I mean, like, I understand why they did it, but the, uh, little follower on the, uh, tube magazine is just like a bright fluorescent orange, and, uh, I don't know, like, when you're, when you're peeking in, inside of the gun, sometimes you catch a glimpse of it, and I understand why they did it, you know, so, like, new shooters, like, realize oh my gun is empty or oh my gun isn't empty because i don't see the orange i don't know i don't know if they make like a replacement that just has like a standard black uh follower if they do i'm probably gonna end up getting one because i it just it bugs me it's sort of like um putting a spoiler on a vintage chevy or something you know this thing is just smooth as butter my god <laughs> um the intended uses on the website include target plinking 
utility. And I found that it's perfect for chasing motherfuckers on a stolen motorcycle. I guess I'm gonna quit stalling. I'm gonna shoot some shit. Him another dose. Ooh. That reminds me of some people I pissed off. Swallow this. It doesn't taste like lead. That's probably stupid. I'm actually gonna take a drink of this because it kind of looks good. My ankle rig. <clears throat> Fuck me sideways. Yeah, looking at that now, that's, that was probably stupid. Yeah. Yeah, that's, uh, that's soda. That was a little scary. The uh, hammer got caught on my glove a little bit. So I had pulled the trigger and it just kind of hung up. And then when I moved my hand back, bang. So that, that was a little sketchy. Oh, I wish 410 ammo wasn't so hard to find. Uh, this has been the Henry Axe. Uh, it's a real doll to shoot. It it really is a ton of fucking fun. Anyways, uh, I'm Mediocre Montgomery. Uh, please like, sub, and share to become a part of the Mediocre Militia. If you think I'm a total fucking idiot and you hate my content, leave a nasty comment.